Hey what's up guys this will be a quick update on Solana as you can see we are currently taking out this all time high around $218 and right now we are currently trading um, around $228 right here so it seems like we have definitely confirmed breakout because if you take a look at the 4 hour candles guys you can see that we had of course first of all this breakout above it then in this 4 hour candle right here couple hours ago you can see that we fell down below this resistance right here and in this liquidity zone right here guys you can see that a lot of buyers been stepping in at this area and right and then we saw this huge squeeze to about 231 dollar so um what i would be looking out for right now in the immediate short term if you take a look you can see guys that we are already up about 16 to 17 percent in the four hour time frame in about two days right now so I want definitely to wait until we will see maybe a retest of this previous huge resistance around $219 guys from the past price action. I want to see a successful retest at this area before I would consider to make my next breakout long trade on Solana because I think the opportunity was already right here to make a huge long trade um, around $220 and right now I would definitely not chase it. And I would wait until we will see a retest of this area right here around $219 again. And if we are able to hold it successfully and we are not uh, breaking down below it, then I think you could definitely consider to make your next long trade from here with a target of about $245 to about $250, guys. So otherwise, if you are breaking down below it and we start closing some candles again in this area somewhere around $216, $217, dollars maybe, then I think a lot of breakout chasers who are currently taking huge long positions right here will start panicking maybe. And then we could go down back to retest this previous resistance around $211. Again as a new support guys because as you can see we have a lot of... Um, we had a lot of um, rejection zones right here. As you can see right here we've been rejected one time around $211. Right here for about two times, right here for a couple of times. And then since we broke out, we retested this area right here successfully at the 4-hour time frame. And that's why I think if we are not able to hold this all-time high right now in the next couple of hours, and we are um, closing again some candles below $219, we could maybe go down to retest this previous support zone um, around 200 and yeah, it would be somewhere around 206 around 211 212 dollar again guys if you are not able to hold this support i don't think so but um if you are breaking down below this support you will see a huge crash i will definitely keep you updated on solana but like i said i think this would be only the worst case scenario right now and i believe that we will go in the next couple of days like i already said in my last video guys to about 245 to about 250 dollar and um yeah, this is definitely my target for Solana for the next couple of days and for the next one or two months. I think we will definitely reach price targets of about $300 to $350 for the long term, guys. I think this is definitely a very re realistic target, in my opinion. I don't want to speculate and tell you that we will go to about $500, $600. Of course, it could happen, but I don't think so because um, we have already a very high market cap for Solana, guys. Um, if you take a look right here, you can see that we have a market cap of about, I think, 70 billion or so. Yeah, 68 billion already. And to keep Solana uh, pushing right now, we need a lot of money coming in. And that's why I don't.